In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to install Blast on a Linux system using Conda or Mamba. For those who know Blast is a tool that is used to find regions of similarity between sequences. All right. So you can install using binaries or you can also install using Conda. For this tutorial, I'll show you how to install using Conda. So we are going to use a slightly modified version of this command here all right so you need to make sure you have conda or mamba installed i have tutorials that show how to install mamba and conda okay, so any of these tools can be used to install so let's go to the terminal and install so it's a very straightforward process what you need to do is to create an environment and install blast in it so you can say conda create dash n and you specify the name of the environment in this case blast you can use any name at all that's also fine okay and then we need to specify channels so i'll say dash c by conda dash c conda watch and i'll specify the tool that i want to install okay so the tool is blast that's how i'm going to do it alternatively you can add the channels to your system then in that case you don't need to bring this ones here but i brought this just in case so here's how we do so let's hit the enter button and then install it okay now what happens is that if you're using conda installation can be very slow so what i recommend is that you use mamba so you can issue the same command like this okay so instead of conda you can also say mamba like this so this will also work Okay, so this will also work. So either way you can install, but I would prefer that you use Mamba to install. Okay, because this one is comparatively faster. Or you can also use Micro Mamba. Okay, so this is going to be the final command. So I'll execute this command. Okay, so instead of Conda, I'm using Mamba because that one is faster. So let's execute this command. So Mamba or Conda, any of them should work fine. Okay, so that's it. So once you do that, you have some text being displayed, and then later you have to confirm. You will be asked to confirm the installation process or procedure or activity, and then Honda or Mamba will take care of the rest. So let's wait for everything to get done for us. Okay, so now I'll type Y to confirm. And once I do that, all the packages will be downloaded, installed, and configured for me. So let's wait for everything to get done for us okay now the installation is complete so if everything is successful then you are going to find a message like this so the message will include the instruction for activating the environment and using blast because i installed using mamba it tells me that if i want to activate the environment i have to use this command if you install using conda then chances are the word mamba here will change to conda so Whichever one you see, that's what you have to use. So now let's test Blast. So I'll clear the screen and I'll test Blast. But before I test, I'll have to also activate the environment. So I'll clear the screen and I'll say Mamba activate Blast. Okay, so once I do that, I'll see the name here. I can now test. So I can say Blast. And for example, I'll say dash dash version. So this will give me the version so that's how it is now i'm not issuing any blast command but it's just to test so everything is okay all right so now i say that the argument i use is not correct or at least something was shown here that's fine so i can just do it again i can say blast n dash version c yeah that also comes fine okay so it's just something to test but so far everything is good so that's how we install Blast on a Linux system using Conda or Mamba. Okay, so now that you are done, I would like you to check this video to learn how to generate a Blast database locally on your PC.